now you're ready to sear that. Now, is this going to be finished in the oven or on top of the stove? Well, I like my tuna raw in okay. the middle. Oh, so you're going to do this warm. on the stove. Okay. So I'm going to get a little. We're, gonna, oh, we're not going to finish though. that in the oven. So yeah, what we, we want to do is make our dipping sauce. Okay. And which, again, um, one quart of soy, light soy. I like less sodium. Okay. Good for my high blood pressure. Yep, which is probably soaring now after being with me for an hour. Oh, not true, not true. Say that. And then I'm one quart of teriyaki. <laughs> and then um, we take some limes, um, cut them in half, and, and juice them. Okay. Again, these recipes will be on our website and yours. So it's some and teriyaki. I'm, I'm not going to do the mixture, but you get the idea. One quarter, mm -hmm. one quarter, and a half with lime juice. Okay. And then, like I said, if you want to cheat, this stuff is a very good product, yeah, and I, I use that. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I, I use this, and then I just doctor it up. Oh, gotcha. Put okay. some more lime juice Make in it. Make it easy for us. Yeah. Like you said, you start with a good product. You don't have to do a bunch of stuff. I'm going to get you a cutting board so that you can slice that. Okay. Because I think you want to do that. And again, you can put this to the side if you want. Mm -hmm. You can uh, put it in the oh, oven. Oh, I see. If you, you can cut off a, let's say uh, you like it. Um, you don't like to eat raw food. Mm -hmm. Just cut a piece off. I can eat mine raw and, and then take yours, put it back mine, in the oven. Yeah. And this is how many ounces? That looks like a very generous. It's about a piece. pound, yeah. About a pound. We usually figure on a portion being eight ounces. So oh, so about half, half a pound of that. per person. Right. Yeah. And again, I'm searing it on all sides. Yeah, that's true. And cool. I always recommend if someone wants to eat sushi out of my place, I always recommend it. Sear it first. Get all Sears those. It? Oh, yeah, okay. get, get the airborne contaminants that are attached to the outside of the fish mm -hmm. and then eat the inside raw. Oh, okay, gotcha. That's a great tip. Then you can't tip. go wrong. Yeah. Because the inside of fish, I understand, it's sterile most of the time or no? Well, it hasn't touched the air. And that's yeah, so that's, okay, so we're, I'm going to put. All right, so we're just going to take that and. And cut that on the diagonal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great idea. And you get more surface area too. It looks beautiful. Well, see, it's, it's cooked. It's just a, sort of like a, when you do fillet of beef. Mm-hmm. And that's your favorite. You know what? I think it's been. Yep, I think this is done. Okay. Um, so I'm going to pull this out. Always when you pull a pan out of the oven, have a mitt ready. We, um, it, there's a lot of the pans I use have stay cool handles, Tom, but not nothing stay cool when it's in the oven. No. And I always leave the the mitt or the towel yes. on. That way people know that looks beautiful. Oh, that's very pretty. Yum. Okay, here we go. Okay, so we 